Hello and welcome back to another video from the Greatest Trail on YouTube and it is Grid Auto Sport again um, in this touring season uh, for our second event of this Auto Sport Touring Championship out of obviously six events so it's going to take a while but it's uh, the same format that we had last time uh, one qualifying session and then two races but I have a feeling um, this track isn't going to be as nice as Brands Hatch was. Uh, as you can see, 11 point lead, a second and then a first in that fantastic race last time, chasing Raven West down for the constructors as well. Um, but yeah, as I just said, I don't think this is going to be as easy because it's a tight track. There's, there's not much time to gain really apart from maybe a few corners. Um, event rival is Diego Gomez um, but we're qualifying again here last time it went pretty well we got pole position can we do that again unsurprisingly Evan Kennedy is the man on pole as we break down hard into the first corner and well that was just a bit of rustiness from me there I think we lost a bit of time but yeah compared to Brands Hatch this is not great for me at all here. Uh, obviously we almost got it, well, there we are, second, so again, uh, Brands Hatch were dominating most of the time, apart from the mistake that we made on the lap too, but um, although we are just up there, I think the fact that maybe, oh god, it's this corner again. Yep, I mean, that is a corner that just messes me up around here for some reason, I don't know what it is, but Every single time I go through that corner I seem to run wide, it is quite unbelievable really. I'm pretty much nailed down on the rest of the track as we go 7th place there, that's about where I expected to be. And we did run wide there as well, this hasn't been a great start so far. Maybe because I'm doing this earlier in the day I may be struggling a bit more, but we are quite far down there in the first uh, sector down in 5th place, now we've now gone down to 11th, so uh, this isn't looking like it's going to be easy for us at the moment. And I keep I always, I always just forget that it's that corner coming up, it's just so tight, so much tighter than you would expect. And now I've got one more lap to do it, otherwise, well, I'm going to be starting very far down here, uh, and our championship hopes are going to start looking a bit less good as we're on to the final lap now we took turn one the best we have probably in the whole of um well the whole of this qualifying as we got oh god well that might just cost us although we we actually did, still up there we're still uh fifth so i mean just shows how bad our first sex times have been so far but right we're coming into this corner now we're down in seventh so we've got to try and nail this corner we took it better than we have done anyway, uh, before anyways. Um, coming through now, we might be able to get into at least a top 10. We're currently 7th. 7th will do considering how bad this qualifying session has been so far. We accelerate down to the line and we've gone 7th, which is kind of where I expected to be. But uh, was that that corner cut? Who knows what could have happened. Uh, but I'm guessing my two championship rivals, Aaron Wesley and, yep, two Raven West cars right up there. Nine tenths quicker than me. Uh, we're going to struggle to get past those kicker cars as well in this race. So uh, I'll take a top five here and then try and win on the reverse race probably. Um, but here we go. This is the first race of this event. The leaves are coming down for... Dr dramatic effect I guess I don't know what that's all about really but here we go this is a big race we couldn't quite beat uh, Nathan McCain last time but it's Aaron Wesley on pole this time as we come down to the first corner it's pretty tight the kicker cars have got into each other there's been a major spin a major spin and we've gone round the outside of everyone it was Nathan McCain that got hit our main championship rival and well I guess that was expected I mean this is Grid Auto Sport and the AI are slightly manic on it, but I don't quite know what happened there. It seemed like maybe one of the kicker, it looked like kicker cars were quite close, and then one of them maybe just got into the side of Nathan McCain. Another car came flying up me inside. Um, so the kicker cars still looking 
decent. I think they're still second and fourth. Aaron Wesley looks like he could uh, run out the winner here um, because it's going to be difficult to catch up the front two as how much of a gap they have now. But uh, Nathan McCain is down to last place. So despite being down in third place here, we could extend our championship lead. As we get a bit of a corner cut there, which isn't going to help our case at all. As we've now got Evan Kennedy pushing us uh, from behind. Our teammate is just ahead of Evan Kennedy, or Nathan McCain even. Telling him to attack now. But uh, looks like uh, Kurt Wittenstein is actually getting closer to uh, Aaron Wesley, which I didn't expect. Uh, but it would be a great result for us if uh, Wittenstein could get ahead. Although the only problem is, is uh, we maybe do need to capitalise because if it stays how it is, Nathan McCain's going to be on pole in the next race and he'll surely dominate from start to finish. Evan Kennedy looking feisty up the inside here. A lot later on the brakes, where is he? He's gone up our inside and, well, I can't really complain about that. That was actually a, a pretty slick move by the AI. But now I've got to try and come back at him. I, well, these kicker cars all of a sudden looking very strong in this race. Second and third, they got superb starts as well, but we've got a nice run out of there. Looks like Aaron O'Sullivan is holding a lot of guys up back there so he shouldn't get pressured from behind there. We're having a look here. We tried to go all the way around the outside. Didn't work. We might try and go back up the inside but that hasn't worked either. Looks like there's going to be a scrap with Evan Kennedy for the rest of this race for the final podium spot. They seem to have pulled away a bit. We just don't seem to have the pace around this track for whatever reason. Uh, Brands Hatch was a completely different story but this track, I just don't know. I don't know if it's me or if it's the car, but or if it's a combination of both, but who knows. We've actually taken that quite nicely, though. Uh, looks like we're maybe catching Kurt Wittenstein a bit, as we have a bit of a slide out there. We seem to get a better run out of there than the AI at the moment. And now we're having maybe a look here up the inside. It would have to be a bold move. Maybe we just line ourselves up for a move down the straight. We've taken that a lot nicer than the AI for once there as well. Evan Kennedy getting pressurised but we just don't seem to have the straight line or anything around here uh, to just make a move. It just not quite confident enough on the brakes either. Um, may try and go for an undercut here. We're uh, hitting the brakes. Uh, oh, looks like uh, maybe a mistake by Aaron Wesley there because it's got very close up in front with two laps to go and all of a sudden we could have a bit of a battle on our hands here because the two kicker cars look very quick and then all of a sudden they, they're right up behind Aaron Wesley and we're having a look maybe up the inside of Evan Kennedy into the corner that I hate. We're side by side almost. He's gone defensive. Maybe get a run out of here. We're going to try and go up the inside potentially. Maybe not. We just can't quite get the run. But he must have made a mistake Aaron Wesley or maybe uh, Kurt Wittenstein went for a move up the inside and had contact. And speaking of contact potentially, Evan Kennedy's looking feisty here behind his teammate. And we've got a nice run there and it's a bit wide and we're going to have a look here potentially. All over the place on the curbs and we couldn't quite make a move. I think that would have been the best place to make a move because they seem to be pretty shake out of turn one for whatever reason. But it looks like Aaron West is going to take the win and uh, it could get a bit feisty up ahead with the two kicker cars here. Oh, we've hit into the back here, but we've still got a nice run. And the kicker car of Kurt Wittenstein is looking slow. It looks like his teammate could take him here, potentially. We're not going to have enough of a run. It looks like we're going to come home in fourth place. The teammate's ahead, scrapping over the line, but I think Kurt Wittenstein got it in the end. So, in the end, no changes to position, but it was a pretty enthralling race there. Front four weren't separated by much, but Nathan McCain finishing in... 12th place, oh dear. That's the story of the day, really. So we're going to extend our championship lead, I think. Well, we've extended it over uh, Nathan McCain, who's now down to 7th, or sorry, joint 5th place. Aaron Wesley is now 8 points behind us, and Evan Kennedy and the two kicker cars look all of a sudden very, very good. And they're only 2 points behind the Raven West Motorsport cars, so a very, very good race for the kicker cars. As we're now on to race 2, and this is not going to be easy. Remember the last time I started at the back around this track, ended up finishing way down, and uh, was Nathan McCain up in uh, about fifth place, I think it is. It's not going to be easy to uh, retain our championship lead here, but we are going up to turn one now. We've got to make sure we at least beat Aaron Wesley in this race, as it's quite 
close going into here. Looks like someone's run wide. It might be a team. It is my teammate, in fact. We're side by side with our teammate, who uh, we've now taken. We're trying to go around the outside of Aaron O'Sullivan. We're about the, in about the same place. Uh, Kurt Wittenstein is at the back. It's a great start for uh, the other team kicker card, though, who's already up to 10th place. Uh, Souza still leads, so uh, clearly Aaron Wesley hasn't... Or, sorry, uh, oh, we're trying to go around the outside. Clearly Nathan McCain hasn't had a great start. We're side by side with Aaron O'Sullivan here. Aaron Wesley is now up to 12th. Uh, so great job, teammate. Um, who's now down to 14th, dear me. It's very close here, but we can't quite get a run on Aaron O'Sullivan. Can we maybe go up the inside here? It's going to be close going into 10 1 between a load of cars here. We could have contact, in fact. We're trying to go up the inside. We've made the move. Evan Kennedy having a right old ding dong with uh, someone up there. And in fact, oh god, that could have ended badly. But Evan Kennedy stuck right up behind. Uh, oh, and there's a mistake by Diego Gomez, and we've gone straight into the back of him. That's not helped us at all. But we might get a run on him up here can, since he's so slow. And we're now past um, Diego Gomez. Souza still leads. I'm guessing he's holding on from uh, Nathan McCain up at the front. This side by side action up ahead of us. It's looking like a brilliant race so far for Evan Kennedy, who is really emerging as a big championship threat now. Uh, Nathan McCain hits the front as well, which is not good news for us. Uh, Aaron Wesley now up to 11th, so he is right with us as well. Uh, they're battling up ahead. It's still quite close from third downwards, you would say. Front two have maybe pulled away a bit. But we're having a good run up on Axel Berg now, who doesn't look at all quick around here. Going round the outside, potentially. We've done it. Round the outside. We're trying to go round the outside of Sophie Miller as well. We've got it done, have we? We're side by side. This is fantastic racing. Unbelievable stuff. I'm, this last couple of races, this game has just been so enjoyable. Trying to go up the inside of Varga now. We've got a slight touch from Sophie Miller, but we're past Varga as well. Unbelievable. Evan Kennedy now up to six. We're up to sevens. We're making our way through the field very nicely here. This is high e action, high impact. So Nathan McCain hasn't exactly run away with that how you would have expected him to. It looks like Al Evan Kennedy tries to go up the inside. They're very slow. And now we're right onto the back of him. Oh, in fact, we have gone into the back of him now. Second still looks like it could be a possibility here if we uh, have a good end to the race. And now look at this. He was slow there and we're taking Evan Kennedy round the outside. We're side by side was our championship rival. And it could be free abreast into here. Hannah Wolf, who's not... That quick, we're trying to go around the outside. We've got it done. Or have we? Yes, we have. Up to fifth place now. Unbelievable stuff. Evan Kennedy also makes his way through. Well, this has been a fantastic race so far. Evan Kennedy having a look around the outside now. Nathan McCain still leads. Looks like he's going to take out the win. Oh, Evan Kennedy slams his way up the inside. And again, I can't complain about that. This is second race in a row. is just pulled that move on me and it's worked to perfection both times for him. Evan Kennedy, um, not quite sure what's happened to, uh, we just seem to get such a better such a better run out of there which is really helping us a lot in this race. Uh, second again still looks like it's on the cards though. Having a look, oh it's a big mistake by Sousa there who's fell down to fourth now. It slowed down me and Evan Kennedy, Evan Kennedy not leaving me much room there up the inside so we couldn't quite get him. Uh, seems like Aaron Wesley's fell down a bit, so we could have his new second place man here. Um, as it's side by side up to here, both battling with Souza. Can we take both of them? Evan Kennedy trying to perform that move that he did to me. He's pushed him out wide. He's slightly run wide, and we might have a look here. Not quite in the end. It's me versus Evan Kennedy for fourth place here. I think that's going to be our best result, unless the two in front hold each other up. We're going to look around the outside as we usually do through there. Couldn't quite get anything done. Are oh, we going to have a look up the inside here? It's shades of the last race. Me and Evan Kennedy, nose to tail. We're having a look around the outside here. Can we get on the power earlier? Not quite. It looks like the two cars in front are just going to be able to hold us off. Looks like they're in the same team as well. So they're having a very, very strong uh, race here. But it looks like we're going to come home in fifth place, which is another solid result. The two Raven West cars have both picked up wins, but we've been consistent enough to uh, probably equal points um, so where did Aaron Wesley come home in the end that's the question I want to know uh, Aaron Wesley 8th place so we've gained points on him quite nicely there Nathan McCain takes 9 points out of us but Evan Kennedy is looking like the big rival now uh, two monster energy cars having a great race like uh, 
the kicker cars did, and that uh, might not help us in the constructors either. Uh, as uh, Kurt Wittenstein gets the fastest lap, just showing how quick the team kicker car seems to all of a sudden be. Uh, so we leave the championship by 10 points, but look at that, we've just got a gaggle of cars up behind us that could catch us in the next few events. 15 points separating the top five, but I would say it's looking like two Raven West cars and Evan Kennedy who are going to be the big rivals here, but I guess we'll see. We're now down to fourth in the constructors, uh, thanks to my teammate, which isn't exactly ideal to be honest. So we can complete an event with uh, out a collision. But uh, yeah, that's another strong showing from me there, I'd have to say. Um, fourth and fifth. Some great racing there as well. Um, so I mean, it was pretty good in the end. Um, as I've got the Hockenheim ring coming up next, which I expect to be another strong track for me. So uh, I mean, it's looking good for us at the moment in this uh, season two to take away the championship maybe I should put it up to very hard at the end of this season I guess we'll see how good I get at this game but um, we're just gonna skip through this now and uh, this is where I'm gonna end the video um, so thank you for watching it's been another crazy crazy um, few races here where we've retained our championship lead but um, the team kicker cars all of a sudden look like they're in fine form, so we're going to have to watch out. But uh, until next time, thank you for watching, and goodbye.